guys! Today I am back with a what's in my bag video. It is an updated one because I did one last year I think it's been. Um, I will put the link to that one down below if you guys are interested. And yeah, so I am going to go straight into um, the what's in my bag. Yeah. So this is the bag that I have been using, it is the Alexander Wang Rocky, which is the smaller one of the Rocco and um, yeah this is really is the perfect size for me, I didn't want to get the bigger one just because I already have like loads of oversized and big bags, I just wanted one that could fit in the everyday essentials when I go out and not have like too much space left over. So I went with this one and I got it in Heathrow Airport. I have a feeling it's the new terminal, so terminal 5. This has replaced my mulberry bag, like I still have my mulberry bag and I still use it from time to time, but I just prefer this. Yeah, so let's enter my bag and see what's inside. So first things first, my bag is pretty much dominant by my wallet because it is huge. I still use my mulberry wallet and this one. Well, the Mulberry set was my mum's, but she handed it down to me. But yeah, this has been my trusty wallet and it has definitely been through a lot of use. There's, there is like a few marks on here, I think, and especially on the inside. But I do love this wallet. It fits pretty much everything in. There's so much crap in here. Like, it's ridiculous. There's so many like coupons and cards and like loyalty cards and... Yeah, there's just so much crap in there, so I'm not going to go through that today. Um, next, we have my sea salt spray. This spray is literally amazing. Um, it really does give you kind of like day two hair on day one. It's by Mark Hill, by the way, and I picked it up from Boots. We have Nivea Lip Balm. Um, my lips always get really, really dry, so... I definitely needed this, but to be honest, this doesn't really work. Like, I think Vaseline is the only thing that works really good on my lips. This stuff doesn't really work, but it smells really good, so I think that's the reason why I kept it. Um, then we have my keys. Uh, we have this Lazy Pea line yard from, like, an event I went to, like, when I was, like, 15 or something. I remember it was, like, a key and lock, like, under 18s, like, club night. And it was a key and lock theme and, you know, girls were given a lock and guys were given a key and if you guys match then you meant to hook up or something. But nobody opened my lock, which is really depressing. But, um, yeah, so that's my line yard and I have a Starbucks card, I have my house key, two house keys, and my little voodoo bear, which is from JJ Market in Thailand. Uh, then we go on to my Bobbi Brown perfume. Um, it is the Almost Bear and it's just a pretty kind of like a little bit floral and a little bit musky. Ooh. I have some crystal light packets. If any of you guys know what they are, I think the Americans might do, but it's kind of like instant peach tea. Um, so sometimes when I go to places and I don't want to drink water, um, I just pop these powder things in and you shake it up and yeah, it's just instant peach tea. And got a pen. We got some cinema tickets for 22 Jump Street, which I went to saw the other day. Um, and obviously lady stuff. Um, is in there as well, but obviously I'm not going to show you that because that's just bloody weird. Um, but yeah guys, that is the what's in my bag updated video and I hope you guys enjoy it. It was just something fun and light. Um, also, all the things that I am wearing will be linked down below except for this because I picked up in store and it's from Forever 21. For everything that I'm wearing, all my rings and stuff like that, it will be linked down here. Bye guys!